Hey guys, we're going to be making a air powered rocket launcher out of half inch PVC pipe today. So you're going to need three 12 inch pieces, five 6 inch pieces, two 3 inch pieces, two 45, two T's, and five caps. With one of your half inch caps, you're going to need to drill a half inch hole in it to accept a straighter valve. bottles we've made in the past and these ones are the ones we figured out that work the best and all we use is a sparkling water bottle you can buy these from the store they're pretty cheap and why we use these is because they actually slide on the pipe like perfectly and then they're like a little bit tight and so I'm just gonna be showing you how to make a rocket for your thing out of a sparkling ice bottle and so we already have these pre-cut out wings we cut out of a yogurt container and we are going to be using those they're pretty easy you just have to make them shaped kind of like a cell and first we're going to cut off the top of one of these about down this at the white there and that will go right there so you can put a little bit of rocks and gravel in that and it'll make it a little bit heavier so it doesn't fly around in the air and then i'm going to use electrical tape because it works pretty good on the bottles and just go around it okay once you get that you are gonna want to put a cap on the top so it holds stuff and then just wanna tape on the wings. Okay guys, we're back and it's the next day and today we're going to be launching the rocket. And first thing you want to do is you want to put tape around that so it seals the rocket from any air or stuff coming out. And then you want to fill it just over halfway full of water and then you'll be good. Ouch. Oh. 
40, 60, 80. Wow. Boeing wants better. Hey guys, it was a pretty fun time. The four wing end up, up flying farther by about 45 ish yards. And the three wing didn't work as good. But next time we do it, we'll have to work on a launching mechanism because it was kind of a joke and it looked like it was going to explode in our faces. But we'll see you next time for our video.